Hey all, so in my last video, we covered an app called Vibe, which was an amazing app for creating unlimited transcriptions on your Mac laptop or desktop. And it's fully featured and free and open source. And so that means you have everything done on your local computer, it's private and no cost. So definitely check out that video if you haven't already. Uh, so I wanted to show you how much you could save on this solution that I'm about to show you. So otter.ai is one of the most popular transcription apps on desktop and mobile. And if you see here, they provide a free version and they have the pro version. But if you look at this, they have 300 monthly transcription minutes, 30 minutes per conversation, and you can only import and transcribe three audio or video files lifetime per user. So that's pretty paltry if you are doing a lot of transcription or you just want some options. So, you know, you're gonna run out of that quota really quickly. And so, you know, instead of paying 833 a month or just month to month, they're charging about $17. So uh, this solution could save you quite a lot of money. Uh, but after that video, I was like, oh, uh, what if I'm on the go? What if I wanna do this on my phone? Um, is there a, a solution for that? So that's what led me to this app over here. And it's the best solution I found for Android. So let's dive into it. All right, guys, so I'm going to be downloading this fresh from the Play Store. And instantly like that, it's installed. And so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is go down here uh, to the settings and download the language packs. And you just, I'm just gonna get the English because that's all I'm, I'll be translating. But that's the other beauty of this uh, app is they support other languages. So yeah, if you are doing multi-language transcription and you speak any of these languages, this is for you. Okay, so let's let this finish. Okay, so it's installed, so we're gonna go back and back. And as you can see at the bottom right, it has a uh, recording as well. We'll get into that later. And first I'll show you this transcription uh, sample. So you could tap into this. And I love the UI here. You have each of the little segments broken up. Uh, with the time codes and you could even edit the text and let's and it has uh, ergonomic controls at the bottom with um, nice sized controls so let's listen to the transcription welcome to easy transcription your go-to app for transforming speech into text with precision and privacy right on your device here's what we prepared for you read and listen listen to the audio while reading the transcribed text change the playback speed and the text size to make it even more comfortable. So as you see here, it has a really nice user experience where it highlights the text that's being spoken at the moment. So really nice touch there. Uh, you also have the speed controls. And let's see here, we have, we have changing the defaults for the rewind speed and fast forward length. And we could also turn on loop. So if you want to listen to something or a track a few times. And this is really beautiful, the uh, skip silence. So if you have a transcription and you want to skip all those silences to cut down your listening time, that's really convenient. If you talk like me too, uh, I have a lot of pauses in between my speech. So I would turn this on a lot if I'm listening to my own recordings. Now let's go back. I'm going to show you a sample of pulling in a transcript from Notebook LM. I also talked about this in my last video and I did a whole video just on Notebook LM. It is mind blowing technology and it's what's inspired my search for a transcription app. So 
definitely check out that video if you haven't already. It will blow your mind. I am sure that if you check it out, you're going to love it. Okay, so now I'm going to import a file. Okay, so I'm going to import this file. And as you can see, it is already starting to process with this progress bar. And there you go. It's already processing. If we go into it, you can see it's it's, uh, it's in the process of transcribing. Okay, so it is done transcribing. And check this out. This is actually from a notebook LM that I did for this app. So let's listen to a bit of it. Ever wish you could just like hit record and capture a thought and have it, you know, transcribed instantly? All the time without sacrificing your privacy, like no dodgy Wi-Fi networks or sending your voice data off to, you know, who knows where. Yeah, I feel that it's always that little voice in the back of your head, isn't it? Like, yeah. who else is listening to this? Right, exactly. But what if I told you there's this new Android app and it kind of does all of that? So there you have it. We have our transcription from a Notebook LM audio. But remember, you can do this for any audio file and you could do this for any video file. In fact, let's do that next. All right, so let's try a video file now. Okay, so I just pulled in a TikTok video that I did and I'm going to see if it could transcribe. And there you go, it is ready. And so let's see what that looks like when we play it. This week on Sushi Cats, our perfect chefs claw their way to the top in a whisker-closed sushi showdown. Precision meets claw some creativity, but only one will be crowned the cat's meow of sushi. Who will roll away with victory? Find out this Thursday at 8 p.m. Okay, there you go. So it handles video files really well, and I love that you can see the preview of the video that you pulled in. You could change the size of the video beautiful so if you like that video don't forget to subscribe to my tiktok i have very minimal followers so i would really appreciate any uh help there and there's one more use case that i want to show you which is the voice recorder so let's see what happens when i hit record all right give it permissions allow and now we are just recording my voice right now for a demo. Let's see how this handles voice recordings. Some use cases for this is, you, you, let's say you're in a meeting and you want to record and get transcription notes later. Or if you're in class, you want to get your meeting notes transcribed. So go ahead and do that. Um, one thing I'll note is I, I can notice that the visualization here of the audio, it's a little lopsided. So it's just my designer eye is getting annoyed here, but otherwise it's beautiful. Okay, let's stop that. And look at that, it's, it's transcribing immediately. Let's see how long it takes. It's just processing right now. And there we go. So it's transcribing a little bit more and it's done. So let's hear that again. Hello. And now we are just recording my voice right now for a demo. Let's see how this handles voice recordings. Some use cases for this is, you know, let's say you're in a meeting. There you go. So we covered all the use cases. Let's go back. We covered an example transcription. We covered a transcription from an audio file, from a video file, and from a voice recording right in the app. Um, one thing I wanted to cover is that I did see in some forums that the author of this, Digipalm, they did say that it's not fully open sourced. So they based it on open source code, 
but they do plan to monetize it in the future so that's something to keep in mind but right now it's completely free and it still will be private and offline but i just wanted to highlight that that they did express that they do want to monetize it in the future so just be aware of that but for now this is the best option that i found so far and i will let you know if i find a better one but from my research this checks all the boxes so hope you enjoyed that if you did don't forget to hit like hit subscribe leave a comment if you have any questions it really makes a difference for me it, it will definitely make my day and you know this is uh all i'm doing right now so it goes it goes a long way if you subscribe so thanks very much for listening and i'll see you in the next one nomaditsu